Welcome back to Indian Times Daily. The top 10 headlines from America are Secretary of State Rex Tillerson has reached for a three-day maiden official visit to India. Tillerson will call on Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi and is scheduled to meet Indian External Affairs Minister Sushma Swaraj on Wednesday. America has recent support to India in a move to maintain balance in geopolitics should have more economic content. The Indo-American Chamber of Commerce said that it was important to give a strong economic help and gravitas to these developments to make it sustainable and enduring. Police have found the body of a child near the residence of three-year-old Indian-American Sharon Matthews who has been missing since October 7th. The body was found inside a narrow 75-foot culvert less than a mile away from the home but is yet to be examined for positive identification. The US has been seeking a broader role for India as a strategic partner across the Indo-Pacific region. Secretary of State Rex Tillerson said that the scope of the relation of the US with India was not confined to South Asia and was wider with a strategic importance. President Donald Trump's possible trip to the demilitarized zone separating North and South Korea is still being worked out. However, he's most likely to visit Camp Humphreys, a military base about 60 kilometers south of Seoul, but the time limit may not permit to do both. A top prosecutor of New York has launched a civil rights investigation into the Weinstein, co-founded by Hollywood producer Harvey Weinstein. The Attorney General's office has sent a subpoena to the company, seeking internal documents on harassment complaints and criteria for hiring, promoting and firing employees. President Donald Trump has denied a widow's account of the condolence call he made to her after her soldier husband was killed. Trump in a tweet said that he had a very respectful conversation with the widow of Surgeon Lark David Johnson. American car maker Tesla has struck a deal with the Chinese government to establish a manufacturing facility in Shanghai. It will allow the automaker to build a wholly owned factory in the city's free trade zone, enabling Tesla to cut down production costs. President Donald Trump has defended his regular use of social media after heavy criticism. Trump said that he might not have won the election without it, adding that he could bypass what he labels unfair media coverage by speaking directly to his followers. Tech giant Samsung Electronics and Apple will face each other in court for another trial looking into design patent infringement. The federal judge has signed an order instructing the two companies to return to court and said that the owners would be on Apple to make its case. I'll be back still locked onto the IndianTimesDaily.com as the news from Gujarat and Punjab follows.